The case of the girl in the red dress. Red dress, redress. Uh, by. Per, why do I not have this up yet? Okay, Justin. Yes, your name is Justin. If you have a last name, that would be cool too. Hey guys, Game Hunter here, and we're looking at another game from the Seven Day Roguelike Challenge of 2013. And uh, I always, I, I always called this the case of the red girl in the dress, or the case of the girl and the red dress. And I just, how did I mess that up every single time? Anyway, this is uh, with LibTCAD, and it's actually using a bit of a mask on it for once. I'm not seeing the obviousness. It's just there's a DLL in here. Anyway, controls. Written right there. Love it. For 70 RLs, that's simple. It's awesome. I like it. Anyway, movement is arrows. Fire revolver is S. Pickup is G. As in get. And inventory is I. And I guess just you use items by using them from your inventory. So let's get moving. Let's get moving. I cannot use numpad. I cannot use WASD. I can only use arrow keys, which is okay. I wake up in a haze. I'm in my office alone with a large lump on my head. Where's the dame and what happened here? Or maybe I should... <clears throat> I, I don't really know a noir, film noir voice. Like, I wake up in a haze. I'm in my office alone with a large lump on my head. Where's the dame and what happened here? Press enter to continue. Oh, cool. So this is the giant room and we don't get to see any of it. Okay, interesting, very interesting. Um, yeah, I really don't know how to do a noir accent. Uh, whatever, I'll just do what I've been doing with the gruffness. Bob's remains are splattered on the floor next to his desk. At least he went out with a fight. Unlike me. Wow, Bob's remains are two tiles wide. That's, oh, right. Two thugs are waiting for me in the lobby. Chumps. I'll give him the old one-two for Bobby. All right, well, we'll get him into the the hallway. All right, cool, cool. Oh, wow. You, sir, have been redded. Deaded. Man. This is a thug, thug. Thug, thug. That is all that is left. No, nothing in the closet. Yeah, of course there isn't, Mr. Mr. Noir Man. So who's the G? Ah, it's a gangsta. Gangsta, gangsta on the top of the hill. Um, it's a bandage. Let's get that. Can I pick up these? No, I can't. Can't pick up the gangsta stuff. There's little reason to kill these guys exactly, but whatevs. I'm I'm all about mass murder in my own area. Actually, I don't know if. I mean, is this a familiar place to me? More bandage. This is just a corpse another corpse this is an am oh this is ammo neat I didn't I was about to stay keep that away but the revolver now has six shots I don't know Let's figure that one out uh, the storage room always gave me the heebies I guess this place knows this dude knows the storage or this place that I'm in so there's that um, I can't move Oh, you can attack diagonally, though. That's fair. <laughs> Whatevs. Oh, we got double bandages, so that's good. I don't know how much the bandages heal, but I'm probably going to wait until I'm about half HP. Uh, I'm going to assume that they're buff roughly 10, maybe 5. Utilities and maintenance. Not sure what's back this way. Smells like poo. That's what a noir man would say. Smells like the dog's next door neighbor. <laughs> right. So I guess this is underground, yeah. It's just... Utils and... Ooh, I got rocks. Use the rock. Oh, I, I can actually throw it. Ah, oh, dag nabbit. Escape automatically quits. Uh, how do I unuse some... Well, let me just get right back to where I was. Super duper right back to where I was. <laughs> and back we are. Okay, good. So now... Yeah, I'm, I'm going to just try to see how well I actually sync that together in post. Auxiliary exit right on time. Oh, we're going to go... Huh. I feel like I should explore the rest here, though, just to, just to be able to explore it all. Like Dora. Dora! 
the Explorer, which clearly doesn't rhyme. Come on, children's video series. You gotta have more than that. No one in the security office, typical. But we do have ammos. That's That could come in handy. I'm gonna assume this is locked. They even got the receptionist. Poor, oh, they even got the receptionist. Poor Sally. I don't know. Whatever. Oh, man, stupid diagonals. They can attack diagonal, but they can't move diagonal. I don't get that. Seven, no eight. Ten goons near my car. I gotta find another way out of here. But with the bandages, I'm sure I'm fine. I don't know, whatever. I guess we'll just go into the auxiliary exit then. I must say, you know what? This looks really nice for ASCII-based stuffs. Just, just gonna throw that out there. If you wanted to make a game that is ASCII but kind of tiled at the same time, you know, not purely console but nonetheless has that feel, I think this is a really good design. This is a really good aesthetic choice there. I remember to take the girl's file with me when I left. This check out of her address. Wait. Time for a look. Okay, so I guess I just kind of found her address or something. I don't know. Something. Okay, so I'm at half health. Let's go ahead and try one of them bandages. Four. Okay, well, they're not nearly as good as I thought, unless they're kind of randomish. Nope, four. Always four. So I may even want to potentially consider using my revolver at times. Empty. 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 That's. Yeah, that's devil Satan speak. At the same time, they're clearly two different entities. Natas. Natas. That's is this blocked. A lot of noise out front. More goons, cars. Gotta split fast. I'll try the back. Does that mean they're actually gonna come through, or maybe not? Maybe not. This is the case of the girl in the red dress. Why is this is the case of the girl in the red dress. We haven't seen the dame the whole time. Dame. Why? Dame. I mean damsel? But where does damsel come from then? I don't... I don't... Etymology is not my strong suit. And in fact, I always make a really big deal about it and I shouldn't. But whatever. Also the... Well, I'm sure the, the line of sight stuff's pretty typical for Liberty Cod, but it looks nice. Nothing in the bedroom except a burned out cigar. And a couple bandages, you missed that. Come on, dude. Wait, so... Did I go the wrong way? Because I was supposed to go one way or the other just to get to a spot, but... Was I supposed to use that window over there? Maybe I was supposed to use that window. Or maybe I'm supposed to use the back here. Right? Nothing for me this way, I'm no coward. So, maybe here? I kind of see slightly open areas on those sides, but I don't know if that's something I can use. So where do I go from here? Because there isn't, if you notice in the bottom left and the bottom right, there's, there's nothing, nothing around. Nothing around at all. That's kind of interesting. Don't know why that is the case, but... Like you can see through the diagonal wall. That's that's unexpected. Um, so yeah, where do I go from here? I just fly out the window. Fly out the window. Search the bedroom for porn. <laughs> Under the bedroom. Excuse me. Why? That's that's where everybody hides their stash. Twenty years ago, before the internet. <laughs> Okay, um, man, that's a giant lake pool, isn't it? It's a, it's an Olympic-sized meter squad. Where do I go? Where do I go? Oh, I actually leave this way. Oh, the only, the only thing in the house was a used Cuban 375 or zero cigar. I have a hunch who's behind this. Okay, well, better than I do. I, I think we're supposed to go in here. Yeah, she came to me scared alone. Some. Someone big was behind this with a lot of manpower. Hedge maze. Frickin' hedge maze. Here goes nothing. Alright, so here we go more. Following the trail to... This is quite a hedge maze if it already just goes this far. 
we'll start left uh, and just kind of move from here, I guess. Left hand rule, whatevs. Of course I fail. Well, it's pretty obvious that I was going to with that exit. This one, I don't know. This one could lead to anywhere. This might not even be a very good hedge maze. I don't know. It could be. There was a gang. I guess he got lost. Or she? I mean, gangsters could be she's. Just have some female gangsters. Well, I, it depends on when this was set. Right? I think. Man, oh, this is going to be a dead end, isn't it? This is going to be such a dead end. Or if I'm really lucky, it'll lead back to another exit. So it won't be a complete, absolute waste of my time. But it's not looking that way. So we got to. I guess I'll just back when I'm back until I get to the... You know what? I'll just back when I'm back until I get out of the hedge maze in general, I think. So, yeah. Never mind. I found this. Only Don Corontini fits the profile. His mansion is on the outskirts of town. Luckily, I know a shortcut through the sewers. Oh, and here we are. It's the thug. There's a different colored thug this time. We've got a lot of ammo, don't we? So this is the sewers, and we just go through the sewers, I guess, and just make our way through the sewers, which is pretty much a head maze, but worse. <laughs> go figure, right? Yeah, we got rocks. I guess we just throw rocks. Rocks are... You know what? Let's try using these rocks. Darn it. I for inventory. Rock. Gangster looks concussed and confused, but it didn't do anything. Like, he still attacked me, so not very useful. However, we do have bandages and bandages and bandages. Maybe the the, the other people? Ooh, a grenade! That could be darn useful. That could be darn useful. The darn useful, even. All of the usefuls in one place at one time. I'm just going to go ahead and assume that the bottom left is where I want to go. No idea, but well, I guess I guess I was wrong. <laughs> we'll just get that out of the way, huh? um, and we'll just continue searching until we find this place. So, this roguelike, ah, jeez, not a good place to be right now. Yeah, and, ooh, that was damage. That was damage right there. Dang it! Just use some more. There we go. Okay, and now we're back to roughly. We have a plenty of. Do not press escape as much as you want to. Do not press it. And yeah, we only take one damage from each of these guys, so I'll use ammo when it seems like it makes the most sense. So there's the shortcut. You know, if the guy says, luckily I know the shortcut, they should at least show the where the shortcut is, yes? I don't know. Felt that that should have been something. Another grenade. Another genade. And this time I think I do want to make it my way, well, at least to the outskirts of this area. I wonder if this is random. This seems like it could be random. Oh, and dang, my inventory's full. Well, let's just go ahead and use all of the bandage uh, that I have to uh, you know, collect on. And I guess, yeah, geez, at this point I should perhaps consider using my ammo. Yes, indeed use that ammo because I have a lot of it. Ah, darn it. Can't be wasting all this. Don't. I guess I'll just shoot. I guess I'll. Again. Oh, okay. I, I'm not really sure what happened there. I'm not really sure what. Whatever. Point is, I got lots of stuff, but I don't have a lot of health, so we're going to have to make use of that. 10 damage on that. Oh, darn it, I'm out of shots. So I took a lot of extra hits there. Fortunately, I have ammo, just... Right? Oh, that's only one! Oh, crapsicles. Um, so, we gotta fill all that. Okay, alright, well that's important to know. I thought ammo meant kind of more of a clip, but apparently it means a single bullet. That is something I did not guess for the very first time. However, it does make uh, inventory dealios a lot more simple. 
And it does mean that I probably shouldn't waste as much on that as I thought I was going to, or what have you. So we're still in the sewers. And the sewers are... I mean, clearly this game has a plot, so it probably has an ending, and I feel I should make my way towards that, even if that is the case of just this girl in the red dress. Ow, I'm taking damage and I don't need to be. Why am I such a boop sometimes, all the time? Uh, well, if I had to guess, it's just because I'm talking. Because I'm not paying enough attention. And you know what? I don't even... Well, darn it. And then I took an extra hit anyway. But just... I took another extra hit. Fantastic. Fan the freaking tastic. Let's just see if this leads me out. All the way to San Fran City. Nope. Okay. Although, I didn't really... Press super fast arrow keys. I'm using my piano. Well, I'm not really using them. I'm using two hands at the very moment, just to just to get through here. Don't really want any sort of wrist sprain from something this silly, huh? Because that would be silly. So we're just gonna spam these buttons all the way to New Mexico. All the way to. That was it. Oh, man, that was it. I went halfway. And I for missed the bandage because I forgot that that's different. The mansion of Don Quarantini. Time to get the girl and get out. She's, she'll probably be in a back room somewhere. Well, what is back relative to in this game? That is the question. Come on, gangsta gangsta. There we are. And might as well, again, might as well just use these as I have time to. Okay. Leaving the wine cellar, and I can smell the Don smoke already. I'm going to kill that um, unfriendly man. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm going to guess the back is... Actually, I don't know where the back... Maybe the back is here, because that's kind of where the sewer access was. Kind of makes sense. This is an empty room. So, let's just go all the way over here. I did that with one hand, because I'm amazing. I don't know, whatever. Nope. Dude's got genades sitting in his wine cellar. And uh, a bullet. And a bandage. That is not something I would expect to find in a wine cellar. Not in the least. Alright. Let's make our way... Thugganacious. Okay. So, I don't, still don't know where the back room is relative to this place. I still feel like the back room would be this side of the mansion, but I don't know. I really don't. How much ammo do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I have enough for full revolver shots if I really... Oh, okay. Um, I should probably find the girl first, huh? Probably. So, which means I'm I'm gonna guess I'm gonna guess they're not together. I don't know. I figure just if it's just a normal kidnapping. Ooh, lots of stuff. I found the secret super stash. Dun 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 dun. dun. Oh, man. Um, I just dropped an ammo. Fantastic. Uh, we can use one more bandage though. There we go. And then we just get to the next place and then we go. So yes, right. Um. Oh, that's the entrance? Whoa, lots of dudes. Lots of dudes. But I can kill them one at a time. It's amazing how well this works. I took extra damage, whatevs. I don't even care at this point. It's, 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 that's the game, that's how you play it, and that's, that's the thing. So this game is mostly story-driven, uh, which is to say that it isn't really actually... Well, the sewers might have been random, and the hedge maze could have conceivably been random. Um, so if you had more of that... Oh, sweet... Fr okay, so this is how I leave, but I need to first find the dame, so... we got to do that first. Foist. And we probably also have to kill the dude. Just That gangster was just sitting in the room for no reason. Alright, it looks like the back rooms it is. And then we just find our way out. But we need to not sweep freedom in until we get to the, the Don himself. So here we go. 
Ah, oh, man, really? That's no fun. Uh, I'm gonna shoot you. And maybe ammo up a bit. There we go. Oh, oh, there we go. This is a big room of nothing. <laughs> this is just the most barren mansion I have ever laid eyes on. In the history of the universe. And really, it's, there's no furniture. There's no, no nothing. Gotta use that. Gotta use bandages. Bandages. That was. That's it. I'm. I am out of HP now. I should probably stick to using my bullets. Well, if it isn't Larry, Curly, Mo, and Goon. Okay. We'll just shoot you dead. Shoot you dead, son. Shoot down all the neighbors. Because I have so much ammo. That would have been a good shot for, spot for a grenade, actually. The dame success tastes folly good, <laughs> jolly good. Not time to get us out of here. So what? I just pick her up? Oh, okay. <laughs> I guess she's an item then. Why not? Okay. So the Don isn't around here, unless he's a scripted show up sort of dealio. I hope he doesn't show up when I'm accidentally pushing these buttons super duper fast. So yes. We just go to sweet, sweet, sweet freedom. I, I wonder if we're also going to have to go even farther just to make sure we get even more spaces and places and vertigo drops. Anyway, uh, yes, let's get to this escape hatch. I guess I could have just used that, huh? There's also this, but onwards. I just go, and then I'm done, and then, and then, I mean, right? Can't go this way onwards. Is this the end of the game? I don't know. Is this is this it? Is that is that all there's left to it? I can explore some more, I guess, and go all the way over. So, well, uh, I mean, I don't. This is more of a game than some of the other ones were, I guess, um, than some of the more basic ones. Uh, but of course, it doesn't mean so much to say that I played this for a longer time because it was, um, you know, something that I wanted to definitely... Well, I did want to see it to the end, that's for sure. Um, because it's the kind of game that I can see through to the end. But uh, that doesn't necessarily mean it is of higher quality than games that I have played shorter amounts of time. I just want to mention that. I don't want to name specifics because that would be silly, but... Um, I mean, certainly we've seen games that have more, that I have enjoyed personally more than this game, but, um, and, you know, that I played less, but, you know, it's just, I just want to, I feel bad just saying it like that, because that, that isn't to say that this game is bad at all, it's, it's, it's fitting, and it's, it's story driven, and there's all that, and I, I can appreciate that, but it certainly needs more polish before it's something that, um, would be fully fledged but as a game by itself you could package this and say you know you're good to go so I I can enjoy that much so and it doesn't seem like the game actually ends so anyway this has been the case of the girl in the red dress who is not in my backpack but I'm carrying her nonetheless join me next time when we take a look at another game from the seven day roguelike challenge excuse me of 2013 yeah Burp did not want me to hear it out. Until then, keep playing those roguelikes, guys, and take care.